In the meantime, the national government has embarked on a process of handing over assets of defunct county councils as it finalizes the transfer of all devolved functions. Counties are expected to take over assets, including land and buildings worth billions of shillings, in the final phase of the transfer. The Intergovernmental Relations Technical Committee uh, has until the end of this month to transfer all the functions in line with the Constitution. Speaking in Evasha, Devolution PS Teresia Mbaika uh, said the valuation of assets has uh, kicked off in 18 counties and she said the committee is currently working on the final report on transfer of uh, functions which will be ready by the end of the month. We learn about how devolution can, can be prevented. Currently, the State Department for Devolution, together with other stakeholders and IGRTC, we're in the process of uh, um, finalizing on transfer of functions to the, um, to the county government. The IGRTC, which was the lead on this, it's uh, doing the, um, uh, the, final, the final report for purposes of gazette gazettement and subsequent transfer of the same to the county government, including the resources uh, to this function. Also undertaking the valuation of assets. As of governors and the national government, keep talking. Avoid disputes and as has been emphasized this morning by the Honorable Wetangula. Avoid going to court on each other. Let's use the law as provided. Let's avoid using money we should have used to develop our counties in courts. These last two weeks or three weeks, we've had this uh, thing in Parliament where there was a case about transferring monies on roads to the counties. We have now resolved the matter through talking to each other, and governors had to withdraw the case from court. If we had spoken before they went to court, this would have been resolved. And so as Parliament, we are encouraging the two levels of government, keep talking to each other, be cordial, do pre-consultations before we make decisions. It's going to work better for all of us. But even with the transfer of those functions, even with the transfer of resources, for the, our system of devolved governance to work well, they will still need to keep in good consultation, in good cooperation, in coordination. They will need to see and seize opportunities for working well together in transforming the country as uh, envisaged in the bitter plan.